Hi there, welcome to the Paid Memberships Pro guided video series. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to manually assign a membership level to a user of your site. I will go over some of the methods in this video now, but feel free to refer back to our documentation for more details on these methods. The first method on how to do this involves you as the admin performing a checkout on behalf of the user. This method will work great if you have the user present with you. Simply log out of your administrator account and navigate to your membership level page. Select the desired membership level, input all the relevant members details and check out. If performing a premium checkout, it is very important to let your customer know that you are working with their sensitive billing information and that they need to consent to you accessing this information. You will also need to be very careful not to record or expose this information to anyone who can misuse it. Use this method with great caution. You may be thinking, why would I consider this method? Well, we recently had a member who needed a way to manually check out a user who was elderly and not confident enough to do an online payment. The second method involves creating or updating an existing user's profile and assigning it with a membership level. To do this, navigate to your WordPress dashboard, Users, and select the Add New or Edit an Existing User. If you selected to add a new user, then go ahead and input all the relevant information of the user. Now that the user is created, it is time for us to assign a level to the user's profile. Just a note here that you can follow this step for pre-existing users too. Locate the user profile that you want to give a membership level to. Now, Edit the user and scroll down until you come across the Membership Level section. Choose the Membership Level from the drop-down selection field next to the Current Level option. You will notice the words Not Paying next to this option. This is to let you know that the member has not performed a checkout and there are no payment details linked to the profile. This basically means that the user will have full access to the Membership Level for free unless you've accepted payment for the level in another way. For example, a cash payment or direct bank transfer. Once a membership level is selected, you can now assign an expiration date to the membership level. You can also send an email about this change directly to the user. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you are a premium PM Pro member and feel you need some further help with managing your members, Feel free to reach out to us via our member support forums. Thanks for watching.